for your local forecast. Here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca. Tony. Well, like a shin and the tornado watches a continue across the uh, central plains this evening. Nothing stormy around here. However, by later Thursday night, we have the chance for a few scattered strong thunderstorms. I don't think they're severe, but a couple of heavy thunderstorms are possible. Again, not until Thursday night. In the meantime, we are beautiful this evening. Skies are clear. Looking at Newport right now after reaching the low 70s in many locations. We've cooled off into the upper 50s. 59 degrees seems to be the common temperature just about everywhere. Taunton now coming in at 60 with clear skies. So threat tracker now through Wednesday and even the daylight hours of Thursday, low level green. But by Thursday night, we may may have to bump it up to yellow. Uh, it's not 100% certain that some of these will be strong. I do feel confident of showers and at least some scattered thunderstorms Thursday night. Whether or not they're, they're borderline strong remains to be seen. But this is something that we'll watch. And again, not until the, uh, the nighttime hours of Thursday. Thursday day outside of an isolated shower doesn't look too bad. Skies are clear across New England. Of course, we just showed you the video of that uh, severe weather across the central plains. This is ongoing. I mean, anytime you see this comma-shaped swirl to the clouds and, and radar structure, that's uh, certainly a sign of a well-developed, powerful storm system. The area of low pressure uh, just north of Wichita, that'll track into the northern plains over the next 24 hours. So this really doesn't impact our weather. Look how nice and clear it is up and down the east coast. But eventually, a piece of this energy will break off and arrive here Thursday evening, Thursday night, and that'll bring some scattered showers and thunderstorms. Still getting reports of numerous tornadoes being reported in the last 24 hours across the central plains. Meanwhile, closer to home, we are quiet. We've got a beautiful day coming up for tomorrow. Watch the uh, time bar right up in here. Skies are clear, somewhat cool overnight. Some locations getting down into the upper 40s just before sunrise, but waking up to sunshine, beautiful morning. Nice rapid jump with the temperature. We should top out in many areas in the lower 70s, along with low humidity, lots of sunshine. And what's nice, it's not nearly as windy tomorrow as it was today. Tomorrow evening at 6 o'clock, it's still sunny with temps in the low 70s. And then later tomorrow evening, tomorrow night, mainly clear and cool once again. So very cool at sunrise tomorrow morning, but temperatures do jump rapidly. Lots of sunshine, less wind, and just ultra comfortable for your Wednesday afternoon, reaching the lower 70s and still with that low humidity. But again, the wind not as blustery. I want to jump ahead to Thursday night, you know, talking about severe weather out across the central plains, maybe an outbreak of severe weather in upstate New York. That's why this area is shaded in yellow. So this is the, um, the forecast Thursday evening at 7 o'clock. We're still dry, but we'll watch uh, some of these uh, thunderstorms try to come through Thursday evening and Thursday night. Notice they push offshore later at night, and this should set the stage for drier weather coming up on Friday. In fact, here's your seven-day forecast. Again, Thursday day outside of an isolated shower looks mainly dry. Scattered thunderstorms Thursday. Thursday night drying out for Friday. Saturday day looks dry. More showers Saturday night. Look how warm it gets on Sunday. Sunshine with a temperature up to 80 degrees. Things are getting better. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Thank you, Tony.